people worry Steve Forbes, Ross Perot, they don't connect with Americans. They're too rich. When's the last time somebody said no to Donald Trump? Well, I mean, it doesn't happen often. But, you know, the, the thing, and I think you understand this, we really have connected because I've dealt – in the construction industry with the unions. I've dealt with the construction workers. I've dealt with the non-unions. I've dealt with everything. And I have a great relationship with people, uh, with the police, with the firemen, with the builders, with the construction trades. I mean, I've just always had a great relationship. And somehow it really, I mean, Mitt Romney didn't connect, if you look at it, because so many people sat home, they never went and voted. They didn't want to vote for him for whatever reason, but they didn't want to vote for him. But we are connecting. And I think we're connecting big league when, you know, when I go out and do a speech like the one that I did just before when I was watching you, you know, thousands and thousands of people. And here I and I ended up being late because I'm watching what you're saying. I mean, it's one of those things, but that just shows, hey, that just shows your talent. That's right. Let's let's get to that. <laughs> Donald I Trump. Just, I just spoke with a, a man that respects you a lot, uh, Al Michaels, who's a terrific guy. And he has a lot. He heard I was on your show. And he said, I love Colin. So Al Michaels is a big fan of yours. That's nice. 